Today is September the 3rd, 2024. This is Carmen bringing you your daily Bloodborne Remaster update. No news on a Bloodborne Remaster today. Uh, and we don't really have any gaming news to go over. Except for Concord, boys. Oh my god. Oh, this is comedy gold. So, Concord launched about two weeks ago um, to uh, mixed <laughs> mixed reviews. <laughs> And uh, it was a complete disaster, top to bottom. Uh, a lot of people were saying it wasn't necessarily a bad game, just that, you know, it released at the wrong time, 100%, four years too late. Uh, the MCUification of the whole game didn't really help matters either. Uh, very funny stuff, absolutely. I, absolutely hilarious. Uh, and today, Sony announced that in like a few days, I think. Is it sometime in, December, in uh, September, like in, in the next couple weeks, I know, like in a few days, uh, it will be delisted, and anyone who purchased Concord will get a refund. <laughs> oh my god, dude. I, I like at least expected Sony to try and like maybe give it away on PlayStation Plus. No, sir. They dragged it out back and old yelled it with absolutely zero remorse. That it is hilarious, and it's even better when you consider that Concord was going to appear in Secret Episode, that uh, that new video game show that's going to be on Amazon Prime, I think it was. Oh my god, it was going to be there. And now it's going to just show people, people are going to be like, what is that? What's going on here? Maybe they'll replace it with something else, but it's going to be hilarious if it shows up. Oh lord, that's funny. That, that was... That's the best laugh I've had in a while when I saw that on Twitter. When I opened Twitter and saw that uh, Concord got the axe. Hilarious. Um, let's see here. So, also, in terms of leaks, Midori is back. Uh, she, or I guess he, I guess it is Mystic Distance. Uh, he had, He's a very credible leaker. He got just about everything he ever leaked right. Um, however, he got busted for impersonating a Japanese woman. So, they, uh, you know, they turbo canceled him for it. Well, he's back. And for me, you know, I don't really care that he was doing that, you know, as long as his information is good. I don't care. Uh, like, whether he is, in fact, you know, a Japanese woman or anything like that, uh, like, it doesn't matter to me because I only I only followed him for the information, and the information's good. Uh, he just kind of doubled down on things he'd said before. He said that Kingdom Hearts 4 is coming 2026. He said that Kingdom Hearts uh, is going to be... Uh, in Fortnite and Q1 2025, I think he said. So yeah, pretty cool stuff. Uh, he just kind of doubled down on that. Oh, he said that there's uh, three worlds for it that are confirmed. Star Wars, which we kind of expected. Moana, which I was hoping for. And Treasure Planet. I've not seen Treasure Planet myself, so I don't know. Uh, I find that strange, though, because Disney very much ignores Treasure Planet. So uh, yeah, that's all the gaming news we got to go over today. Excuse me. Uh, we'll be back with Dark Souls 2 maybe on Thursday. If not Thursday, then on Saturday. So, uh, yeah. I'm going to go ahead and get out of here. And no news on a Bloodborne Remaster today. That's been your daily Bloodborne Remaster update for September the 3rd, 2024.